Welcome to the Hot Freaks. Hi guys. I'm Michael. I'm Chili Bean, your host. So today we are doing, we are sampling Fra Frag Out Spice Company. This is a company out of Arvada, Colorado. And it's a veteran owned company. Yes, yes it is. Um, it was founded in 2017 by Patrick Flynn, a combat veteran who served as a 12 Bravo. For you non-military folks, that's a combat engineer. So, and you know me, I always support com a veteran-owned company. So, what we have here is a small sample of the many, many fine flavors that they have to offer us. We are going to start off, it doesn't matter which one we start off with, let's start off with this one. Yay, yeah, boy. This is Combat Canary. This is a poultry seasoning. And I'm going to show you this. We have a... Picture for it, put up here. What? If you know anything about the military, you already know why uh, this this photo is funny. Okay. <laughs> it's my all-time favorite cadence. And I, we've already opened these, and I've, I've tried some of these on some chicken already. Okay. <laughs> That's one way to do it. Yeah. All right. So, you like a little sucker there or something. Mm. Mm. Yes, this is a very great flavor. Mm. It does go really good on chicken. Because, like I said, <coughs> excuse me, I have had had this on chicken before. The ingredients, it's very simple ingredients. Sea salt, chili spices, <coughs> excuse me, garlic, and onion. <coughs> very, very simple flavor, very good flavor, so. Yeah. And you taste in the chilies. It has the very slightest amount of a kick. Yeah, so it's I not overpowering. It's, it's not, not it's not an overpowering heat. Yeah. Okay, so we'll set this off to the side. Unlike most of the things we have eaten. True. Well, the next one we have is uh, one called Shell Shocked. Shell Shock. Shell Shock. And, and what flavor is that? Spicy maple bacon. Because Yes. Bacon. <laughs> Uh, I, I like the design of the label. Yes. Yeah. The design on the labels of each one is awesome, actually. Uh, yeah, and I love this warning here. <laughs> Terrorists are not allowed. Sorry. Okay. So let's try this. Mm. Getting a nice smoky flavor. Got some decent heat. Mm -hmm. Decent heat. All right. I'm going to let you read those because I. <coughs> Hang on. <laughs> okay. Sugar, sea salt. Maple sugar chilies, spices, natural bacon flavor, salt, maltodextrin, modified food starch, natural flavor, contains canola oil, sunflower oil, and smoke, silicone dioxide, garlic, onions, silicone dioxide to prevent caking. Okay. Let's keep it from clog clumping up on us. Yeah. Really good, really good flavor. Um, heat? I'm actually about a two. It does have a little bit of heat. I'd agree with a two. 
Yeah, definitely. Flavor wise, I, I, it's amazing. There, from there. Probably 9.9. 9. The, the, the Combat Canary, no real heat, but it, good flavor. Yeah. It definitely. Definitely. <coughs> yeah. Okay. We should both grab it. Yeah, we can both grab for it. This one is called Fatty, Fatty Cake. cake. <laughs> it has a picture of a cupcake on it. This is a chocolate cake flavoring. So this I think it would go one really good on top of ice cream. Yeah. Or I could I could see you using it as a rub on something. Any kind of um maybe beef pork. Mm -hmm. Then uh slow slow cook it. Mm hmm Smoke it maybe. Good flavor, good smooth though. This um, sugar, granulated honey, sea salt, D Dutch cocoa powder, or uh, buttermilk powder, you know, skim milk, lactic acid. Stein might like it and because cultures. It's buttermilk. Okay. This is a really good. <laughs> well, that one you get a lot of. Oh, oh yeah. Mm. That one tastes like a really good hot chocolate mix, to be honest, to me. Yes. Yes. Uh, no heat. Obviously. Hey, sweet and heat go together. That's uh, all yes. I'm saying. But amazing flavor. 9.9. A hundred. <coughs> hundred out of ten. Would, would recommend. I would definitely recommend all of them. The next one is Medic. This is a Jamaican jerk, and let's see, very simple ingredients, sea salt, spices, chili turbinado, sugar, mm. garlic and onion. Yeah, good Jamaican, traditional, Jamaican. I'd say Jamaican flavors. I guess, I don't know. Good. That smells really good. Mm. Yeah, this definitely <coughs> Jamaican food. Um, Delicious. chicken. Yes. Chicken or pork. Bacon. 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 No context. Anything bacon. goes good on bacon. Yes. Um, just about a meat. About a about a one and a half. Maybe a high two. Low two. I'm not sure. What do you think? Point two. Do you know that? Um, I don't think it's that high. Well, maybe I'm just building on everything else. Maybe. But yeah, it's good flavor. Good heat, I think. I like it. Just enough. Okay, our last one that we'll be trying here is called Fitty. 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 Fitty pass. Get it right. Fitty. Fitty pass. Fitty. Fitty. And this is a mango habanero flavoring. Ooh. So this is going to be a little bit hotter. And the ingredients have sugar. I actually need a kind of light on here so I can see. Sugar, um, amateur, mango powder, chilies, sea salt, spices, garlic, onion, crystallized lemon, citric acid, lemon oil, lemon juice, crystallized orange, 
citric acid, or orange oil, orange juice, and sugar. Okay. So this doesn't say habanero anywhere. It just says chilies. Well, uh, yeah. See, so he's taking the word for it that says hobs in it. Yeah. But I, I believe it. I believe it's that hobs in it. We'll definitely tell. We definitely, we'll be able to. I believe we'll be able to tell if it is habanero in it for one simple reason. The sting. The sting, exactly. Okay. Mm. Get the mango. Definitely get the mango. Yeah, there yeah. it is. That Comes um, in afterwards. Yeah. Plus a sneaky on you. Very sneaky. Um, <coughs> flavor, again, you know, all amazing. these are amazing flavors. Uh, 9.9, 9.9, 9.9, 9 10, I don't even know. I don't even. Eat all well. of these are 100 out of 10, <laughs> flavor wise. Flavor wise, these things are amazing. The mango, heat wise, 2.5. It's about where I'm at. It's amazing. It's a good kick. Yeah. To any kind of food that you want to put it on. Definitely, definitely. Top maybe a, use it as a ta in taco seasoning or something. That's what I was about to suggest. But chicken, pork, beef, basically anything. Mm. Yeah. I definitely think it would, mango habanero would take really good as a ha taco. taco seasoning. Uh, heck, any of this would taste really good in taco seasoning. Well, maybe not the fatty cake. <laughs> but again, <laughs> it depends on the kind of tacos you want. <laughs> Very good, though. Yep. Uh, we will put a link to the description 